What's up, everyone? I'm back with y'all another video now for this one. I just got done binge watching the entire season of the prequel Ted TV series. Now, what did I think of it? Now, I'm not, I'm gonna try not to say any spoilers in this video, but I will say is it's a it, if you enjoy the first two Ted movies, you will enjoy this. Um, I won't say it's as good as the first Ted, but I would say it's probably as good as the second Ted movie. This show is, um, the characters are likable and stuff. It even shows, you know, which is, a lot of us probably expected that. It shows where John Bennett and Ted first smoked weed, and, and it's hilarious. Um, and this show is very funny, um, and... There's some moments that may, that felt like Family Guy in ways, which is funny. And, of course, you know, Seth MacFarlane, he plays the voice of um, Peter Griffin from Family Guy. So, so yeah, and, and of course, he also plays the voice of Ted. So, this show isn't perfect. Um, it's in around the same vein as, like, the second Ted movie. Um, and there's a lot of moments in the show that felt like a bunch of skits and in times. That's not a bad thing, but there's also decent storytelling, you know, some heartfelt moments, kind of, in this, um, season, um, and stuff like that with some of these characters. And so, yeah, I don't want to spoil nothing because there are some decent storylines sprinkled throughout the season. Um, there's seven episodes, and I'm not going to spoil out them, but it kind of ends kind of, like, kind of fucked up a little bit. But I guess they might do another season if this does well on Peacock. Um, so yeah, if I had to rate this show, I would give it a solid, a solid 8 out of 10. I would give it an 8 out of 10, um... Will I watch it again? Yes, it's it's good to watch with the entire family. This film is, and it's one of those time wasters. You know, it's funny if you, it, like we. It's been a while. It's been a while since we had a great comedy movie or a comedy TV show that actually made us laugh so hard, because a lot of comedies nowadays are like are like too safe. You know, the two afraid to offend people and I think that the Ted movies even the Ted TV show um, are the best modern day comedies ever pretty much modern day you know because they because the classics a lot of the classic comedies they had a lot of balls but and then and then they started feeling too safe with a lot of the modern day comedies and Ted kind of changed that formula and they wasn't afraid to offend anybody because comedy is supposed to offend you just a little bit to make a joke, you know. Um, because nowadays, people get offended by a lot of stuff. But Ted seems to, like, the Ted movies and the Ted TV show, they give zero fucks. And that's what comedy is supposed to be. And the Ted TV show was great. It's an 8 out of 10 for me. Very good show. Um... Yeah, and I'm a pretty big Ted fan, and hopefully we get at least one or two more seasons, and then hopefully get a Ted 3, you know, and bring Mark Wahlberg back, you know, to play, also play John Bennett, you know. Um, and that will be cool because if the show does well, I think there should be at least three seasons of the TV show, and then do one more movie to keep Ted one of the biggest comedy franchise out there so that'll be cool so yeah this is a fun show if you haven't watched it yet it's on peacock y'all should definitely check it out if you're a ted fan or if you're a comedy movie fan you'll enjoy it so yeah it's eight out of ten for me so yeah if y'all enjoyed this video let me know in the comment let me know in the comments below did y'all enjoy the show or did you hate the show i like to y'all's thoughts down below so yeah i guess that's it for this video if y'all enjoyed this video please hit the like button please subscribe and share and also hit the bell Stay on the videos I play. Peace out. Hope you enjoyed this video. And I guess I'm out. Peace. That show is pretty funny.